guys, welcome back. Today I thought I'd share my Christmas wish list with you all. I've noticed as I've gotten older, I like find it harder to find things I want for Christmas, which is kind of strange to me, I guess. Like there are things that I want, but like I'm not gonna ask for those for Christmas. No one's gonna buy me a card for Christmas, okay? Anyways, I thought it would be fun to kind of share with you guys the things that I've put on my Christmas wish list so far this season, and maybe to give you some ideas for what you want, even though I wrote like five different kinds of journals down that I want. Christmas wish list, 2022. 2021, okay. The first thing I wrote down was the do it for yourself motivational journal. Um, I've seen this on TikTok and a couple other places. First off, I love journaling. If you hadn't guessed, I goal set in a journal. I journal in my own notebook. I love journaling and this one is like super cute and it has cute quotes in it and places to write in it. And I just think it would be fun. I've never had a like, journal that I have to write in that's like not a normal notebook. A guided journal. I've never had a guided journal before. The next thing on my Christmas wish list is a Hamden's candy cane. I know, weird one, right? I ask for a Hamden's candy cane every single year from Santa. Um, I like the cotton candy flavor a lot and the cherry flavor a lot. There's just something about it that if I don't get one, it doesn't feel like Christmas. They're super good. And they're like, normal candy canes are like kind of thin. These are like thick and it takes me forever to eat it. And they're just like the best kind of candy cane you can ask for. Next on my Christmas wish list is the five minute journal. Yes, another journal. I started doing my own journaling in the morning with a couple of questions, but I would like to get into also journaling before bed, and I think it's a super easy way to just do five minutes in the morning, five minutes at night, be done with it. <laughs> like a no excuses kind of journal that I can pop in my backpack when I go to nanny and like not have to spend 10 minutes trying to take my mild liner and and then writing like my daily intention which i love doing but sometimes it just it takes like double or triple the amount of time it's supposed to and i've seen this one a lot all over social media too and i think it's just cute and fun and simple and again i've never had a guided journal before next thing on my christmas wish list is some brandy melville sweatpants so I already have a light gray and a dark gray of these sweatpants. And the reason I like the specifically Brandy Melville ones is I am really short. Like I'm really short. Like I'm like not even barely five foot. And it cut off right at my ankle where I need them to. They like fit in the right spots and they're not super baggy. So for being short, they're really helpful. And I kind of want a fun color, like a pink or a green or blue. On my Christmas wish list is the Burn After Writing Journal. Yes, another journal. So my sister, her friend got her one of these. And um, when she first got it, I looked through it. And they're all over Target. There's so many at Target. I'm pretty sure they're all the same on the inside. They just have different artwork on the outside of them but they're super cute. Yes. I'm not gonna burn it after I write in it though, cause that's just not my thing. I like to keep a hold of all of my journals. They are records of my life. Journaling is so healthy for you. It's super great for you. Like journaling is one of the best things you can do for yourself. It has changed my life. Thing I want for Christmas is a bath bomb. No, seriously, I love taking baths all the time. I take them a couple times a week. I just literally sit in there, me and my book, reading my book in the bathtub, got my bubbles going. I love a good bath bomb, especially if they're fun. Normally my mom gets me one or two for Christmas. So hopefully I'm gonna get one or two fancy ones for Christmas but I think that would be super fun. I really wanna do 
a like Christmas themed bubble bath night. That sounds like the bomb. Or something else I've been really interested in is a bath tray. You can like set it across the bath and it pops up so I can stick my book on it and not have to like, well, I mean, I guess still hold it, but I can put like my drink on it. But I also don't know if that would work because my bathtub doesn't have enough of a lib on the end, on one end to like set it on there. But I've always really wanted a bath tray too. So a bath mom or a bath tray. Also on my Christmas wish list is a self-developmental book. I don't really have a specific one I want. I've just been super into reading. I have a couple that I haven't read yet. I have several that I have read. This is by far my most favorite self-developmental book. I absolutely love Jen. Her book is so, it's just so fascinating. Like I can't put it down. She tells stories and it's super intriguing and it feels more like a story. Like I'm reading a book book, like a fictional book than I am a self-developmental book. So her You Are a Badass books, there's only one of them I haven't read yet, which is the um, the Habit one. That's the only one I haven't read. I've read You Are a Badass, I have this one, and I have this one. I've read all of them. This one's like more like little Clodies and um, one page ones, and these two are actual books. I dropped it on the floor. I love them all. I've also read Atomic Habits. That was also a good one. Also still very storytelly, but had some more scientific stuff, which I thought was really interesting. Yeah, I've been addicted to reading the last several months. Oh, the book I'm reading right now is not really my fave, but I'm almost done with it. I'm almost done. And also on my Christmas wish list is a locket necklace. I have a lot of lockets. I just think they're really cute and I'm into styling them with my outfits lately. So, boom. A uh, girl always needs a mini brand or two. Yep, some mini brands. I love mini brands. I just like collecting them. I think they're just super fun and cute. I really like tiny things like miniature size sunscreen. So cute. So yeah, some mini brands. Probably like two. I'm a little obsessed. They're just so cute. Christmas wish list down in this notebook. How cute is that? I don't know why I did check mark boxes. I could have just done bullet points because it's not like a to-do list, but I put a little ornament on there. Super cute. Anyways, I hope I helped you guys out with baby giving you some ideas for what you might want for Christmas this year. Anyways, I hope I see you guys again really soon, and I helped you guys out. I'll see you later. Bye-bye. <laughs>